So now that we have an idea of what our 3D printer is made up of, and generally how it all works together, let's talk about taking 3D models and printing them. The basic work workflow that you'll be using is design, prepare, and then print. Now the design phase sees you using CAD software to create 3D models, and these files usually get put out as a STEP or IGES file. The preparation phase of this whole process takes you turning a STEP model into an STL file, which is a stereolithography file, and essentially you can use that to prepare it for your printer. So you import your STL into your printer software, your printer software or your slicer will cut your 3D model and your, you know, your space data up into 2D slices and it will insert some extra information such as you know, the temperature we're printing at and all that sort of thing. So the printer software that I'm gonna be using, there's a, obviously there's a bunch, is Lulzbot's version of Cura. Now Cura was initially um, started by a company called Ultimaker. It's still maintained by them for the most part but we do see some companies taking their own version of Cura out. So if you head over to lulzbot.com forward slash Cura, you'll see the um, free download for Cura and all the related operating systems, which will be good for you to use if you are looking for a free slicing software that's decent enough to get you some good prints. So again, slices take your STL file and turn it into G-code. So G-code is numerically a numerically controlled programming language that computer assisted manufacturing machines use to produce things. Now, let's, get, let's take a step back and have a look at some CAD software. So Fusion 360 is a CAD program from Autodesk that I learned to 3D model on. It's a great starting point. There's a bit of a learning curve, but once you get around that, you start learning to do some pretty cool things. You can also create STL files from just bodies that you create in the software, so it's perfect for what you want to do. And as for slicing software, as I said, there's Cura, there's Cura's open source Ultimaker edition, there's Cura's Lulzbot open edition. There's also Slicer, which is another 3D model slicer. It's very widely recognized as one of the best. And finally, if you want the, you know, the duck's guts, have a look at Simplify 3D. It's easily the best option when it comes to slicing software, but it does come with a price tag. So be mindful of that. Go ahead, grab a version of Cura so we can go through a tour of Cura before we start our first 3D print.